Lately, we've seen a lot of Hollywood buzz right here in Northeast Ohio. The production of a number of Hollywood major films drew interest on a daily basis this summer. And another film is about to get underway in Lakewood. So if you're looking to make it big, listen to what News Channel 5's Gary Abrahamson found out about the next movie crew coming to town. The city of Lakewood is in the spotlight once again. That's where crews will be filming Cleveland, I Love You. The feature film is 10 short films about love through the eyes of Clevelanders. It's really sort of a love letter to the city as told through people who are either currently living here now or were born and raised here. Maybe they went out to L.A., but they're coming back to uh, sort of tell their tale of, uh, of what love is like in Cleveland. People throughout the area are excited that Hollywood is rubbing elbows with Cleveland. I think it's a great idea. Um, the film industry as a whole needs to discover how wonderful Cleveland and the surrounding areas are, and Lakewood's beautiful. Over 20 locations have been picked for filming, which will take place next month. In the meantime, they are looking for local actors between the age 18 to 80. It's a paid position with many roles to fill. And we're going to be working with different directors, actors, and writers here in Cleveland, so it'll be a real collaborative effort. We just want to show the best that the city has to offer. I think it would be fun to be an extra in a movie. You know, it's not an opportunity that we have here in Lakewood or Cleveland. So if you got the acting bug with a little experience, or you have done a play in high school, this could be your big break. I love Cleveland, so I think it's a great title. In Lakewood, Gary Abrahamson, News Channel 5. Auditions for the movie Cleveland I Love You will happen this Saturday from 10 to 3. I think you might see Leon Bibb there. Just head to the Cleveland Institute of Art Auditorium. You'll get free parking. Be sure to bring a headshot, a resume, and a positive attitude about our city. More information is on Newsnet5.com.